Hi, I'm meteorologist Tom Kippen. Here's three things to know for the daytime on Wednesday. We're going to continue with fall like weather along with a chance of rain, but the rain chances go away for Wednesday night on into Thursday morning would clear things out. Temperatures fall off and inland areas could see frost or even freeze conditions. So if you have any plants or vegetation that you want to keep going through the month of September, cover them up tonight with either cloth or paper products or bring them indoors or close to the house. But temperatures bounce back for Thursday and Friday and we're looking for milder afternoon temperatures. So here we go with local three future cast here. You can see we do have rain moving on through here for the daytime on Wednesday. Best chances central and eastern UP and closer to Lake Michigan. And then as we go into the Wednesday night, Thursday time frame, the rain's out of here. We clear things out from west to east. And then as we go into Thursday afternoon, we're looking at bright, beautiful sunshine. Temperatures today around 50 or the 50s, but watch temperatures tonight as they fall on off into the 30s. Wouldn't be surprised to see some inland west areas fall into the 20s tonight near the shorelines and right along the shoreline. So the Great Lakes will have lows tonight around 40 or the 40s, but watch temperatures bounce back nicely for Thursday afternoon with highs around 60 or the 60s. So we got that rain for Wednesday. Highs, like I said, around the 50 degree mark or the 50s for high temperatures. Maybe even a few spots stay in the upper 40s. And then as we go into the daytime on Thursday, we're looking for morning frost or freeze conditions inland, but temperatures bounce back nicely on Thursday afternoon. Look for high temperatures on Thursday afternoon around the 60 degree mark or the 60s. And then as we go into the daytime on Friday, another early morning where we could see frost or freeze conditions inland, but temperatures are going to bounce back nicely once again Friday afternoon. Highs in the 60s to around the 70 degree mark. And then as as we go into Saturday and Sunday, we are looking at our next rain chance to move in. Actually, that's the same storm system that is currently bringing snow to Colorado and western Nebraska. That's going to bring us rain on Saturday and some wind can't be ruled out as well. Behind that storm system, a tad bit cooler with some gusty winds possible, but the sunshine returns for Sunday and early next week. Weather anytime on our website, upmatters.com or WJM at Local 3 app and on Facebook.